it out instead of pushing him away. Okay. He should have just minded his own business. Joe, John, John food and Louie were just about to like finish this up and Gorga pulls him away. Why? What are you afraid of? Let them hash it out. Well, don't it work. I got some words for Mr. Gorga in a few seconds. Um, I guess this is for starting with Louie and you, you do think that he called the investigator Absolutely. I I agree with the street guys on this. I cannot yeah. believe what I'm watching. I mean, it just, it's not even normal. It is like, wait, you just said, you said you called Bodidal. Now you're saying you didn't, but now there's a security guard downstairs from Bodidal. I mean, I, I am, I, li I literally am confused. And you know who's also very confused? You know who also is not a fan <laughs> at all of Louis? Who is Andy? I know he's I been mean, all over saying th that. You some, know, this is. Well, I was going to say there's people on that stage that are not the smartest, the sharpest tools of the shed. But Andy right. Cohen is a smart man. When they're backstage, yes, they were standing there by Gia, and he's like, yep. when he was standing there, like with Louis, Andy was just standing there, like, look, this is his friend Teresa. And we'll get into that that little exchange when they were going back out where he was like, just please, come on, let's just get through this. That was very telling. But yes, it was. He, Andy knows. He he agrees with what you just said. I, I agree with you in the street guys. Like, I don't want this, but I think this is really just not going to end well for her because of this guy. I mean, this is strange. Listen, Teresa is not in jeopardy of leaving. She could have met a nice school teacher who it was quiet and humble. Girl, you still would have your job. Like yeah. of all the men in the entire world to bring My on God. the show. Now we have Polly. We you could have brought anyone on. You could have brought an accountant. You could have brought a bus driver. You have to bring on this this wild card, as you say, Kim. Oh I mean, my God, he's a wild card. Seen even the, even when Andy brings up life. the pajamas, yeah, the pajamas. Now it's a sweatsuit. He wore it once. It was in a bag. Of, like, oh my God. You know what I would like? Oh to ask you? man, who lies? I'm okay, not sure. I'm not sure of the answer. Who lies more? A. Louis Rialias or B. Melissa Gorga. It's a tough one. I think they're neck and neck. Neck and neck? Neck and neck. Neck and neck. Like we're all Listen, sitting I here. Just, we're listening to all these lies. What? It's one thing after another, after another. And, you know, when Teresa stands up screaming at Joe, Joe's like, say it, say it, say it. He knows Teresa ain't saying it. That's why he was so confident. He knows she's not saying it. She's going to protect her family to the end. Not him, just to protect the family name. This, I've, I've, it was straight. And I think when they were backstage, when Andy was just like, he, he, what did he say? He said like, but you just said this or something. You said, I know. He's like, I no, know. but you said it that like Andy knows, he knows that his, his cash cow also friend, like he likes Teresa. Yes. Yes. But he, he knows like, this is not, and it's, it's, I mean, after all this, if Teresa ends up in jail, regardless of that, just being, whatever it is, again, you, I mean, we, you got to feel bad. I mean, I, oh, I, listen, nobody but, uh, wants this for her, for her kids, for, I mean, nobody wants this. I don't think she's going to wind up back in jail. I hope some of her lawyers have her back. I'm hoping. Um, But, you know, this There's situation. There's a lot of other him, things that could happen. I know, but this situation is so bad. It's she's so not leaving bad. him, Kim, though. She's, Never. she's sitting there. No. She's sitting there watching what all the rest of us are watching. And she's not, right? No. She but Because I think she knew. She knows everything that went on. She knew before. Margaret said that she had called her about the son. She knew everything, okay? Um, a lot of people in the comments are saying, you know, don't, don't believe you. They, first of all, a lot of people in the comments have said, you know, you could spoof a landline, which, okay. And they're saying, don't forget that Marge is a filthy liar. I'm just laying the information, everyone. A lot of people think Marge, Mar Marge is lying. Listen to me. Margaret's not going to call the police if she's lying. You cannot You're not report. not going to call the police now. Of course not.
that's uh, against the law mm-hmm. to report. Yeah, that's more against the law than somebody calling your son at work. Okay, so no, I don't believe it. I don't believe she she didn't call. She has a police report. I believe she called Teresa. She was she doesn't want her son. Listen, none of them should have their kids brought into this these um situations. This is a scary situation at this point. People being threatened, people being called, livelihoods are being, being put on the line. People are being called to jail. I mean, wow, just wow. You know who? Uh, this is not what Bravo wants. No. They do not want this. They don't want Kim nope. Richards, the alcoholic. They don't nope. want Lisa Rinna when nope. bots. They nope. shut the shit down. They shut it down. And Nene Leakes will never be back on Bravo. They just did yep. a flashback on Real Housewives of Atlanta. And they took her out. Yeah. They took her out. Yeah. Which by could be way, legal and way. all that. But it's, yeah. they, they, I'm telling you, they, this is not, they do not want this. They want you to fight yeah. over the drink and who was yeah. late yeah. and that bullshit. Yep. In the meantime, Lisa Brenna is um, starring in a movie. Oh, uh, yeah. In New Jersey. In New Jersey, our friend, she doesn't like her name being mentioned. Our friend is um, on the movie set. Uh, Lisa Brenna is playing a, um, a head of a modeling agency. So Rinna's doing good for herself. You go, Rinna. You know, I still but like I need to, Rinna. I, I, hello, Melrose Place. I just interviewed someone from Melrose Place. Yes. It's coming up, yes. guys. I need to know if it's a lifetime, if she's now in the lifetime family. Nothing wrong with lifetime. I'll find everything That shit out. pays well, girl. Or if this yeah, is going to be out. like in the actual movie theaters and Lisa Rinna's going to be I, I don't think screen. movie theater. We'll see. I'll find out. I bet you it's lifetime, which again, people make a lifelong careers. That sure, lifetime shit sure. pays well, girl. <laughs> I'll find um, out the info. So, yeah, I mean, I, I, I agree with that. I am so confused. Look, I do. He probably called the investigator, you know, I mean, now. Oh, did you see, did you see what Bo said about Joe Gorga? Wow. So now. I don't even, what got him so mad? I'm so confused. Why is Bo so mad at Joe Gorga? I'm confused. For everyone who I'm didn't confused. see it, Bo did a <laughs> thing, a, a video. I think that. It's because Fuda is saying that they sat, we, we talked about that here, that they sat next to him one night at dinner. And what were they saying? They were saying something like- what, How did he know where they were going to be? I think something like that. Listen, he doesn't, <clears throat> but Bo Deedle is not happy with Joe Guerra. And let me no. tell you something. A couple of people in this world that I'm afraid of, in no particular order, Chris Jenner, but she'll shut, she'll <laughs> shut, she'll shut this podcast and all of Hollywood down right now. Okay. You okay there, Kim? Now I'm good. Kathy Hilton. I'm afraid of her. You're not afraid of her. Uh, I think, well, you should be, you should be. I think she had something to do with Rena not being there. I'm a, a Louis. I don't know. I think I might be afraid of Louis a little bit because he's Absolutely such a wild card. Not. And Absolutely not. maybe not him, but Bo Deedle. That's somebody you should be scared of. Bo Dito's one of the big boys. I like Bo. Me and Bo are friends.